Welcome to Holy Innocence Children's Hospital in Imbarara, Uganda. The only dedicated children's hospital in Part all five. of Uganda. Support for Holy Innocence began at San Rafael Parish in Rancho Bernardo, California and has spread all over the globe. Come see the impact that caring people have had on thousands of children in one small part of the world. This amazing story began to take form when Holy Innocence Children's Hospital broke ground in 2008. Soon thereafter, the hospital opened in 2009 and has been treating children ever since. Over 35,000 children have been admitted as inpatients with life-threatening diseases like malaria and dysentery. More than 170,000 children have come for outpatient treatment. The result? Thousands of children have been cured from deadly diseases. Fortunately, the Children's Hospital has been able to build new infrastructure and new capabilities thanks to the generosity of its wonderful supporters. Five. Thousands of children come to Holy Innocence Children's Hospital from all over the Mbarara region, an area the size of Los Angeles County. They also travel from Kampala, the capital of Uganda, which is five hours away. They even cross the border from Tanzania, Rwanda and the Democratic Republic of Congo. They come because Holy Innocence Children's Hospital provides the best care in the region for children. Holy Innocence Children's Hospital has grown dramatically in a relatively short period of time. Starting with inpatient and outpatient facilities, it's added a new laboratory, a new pharmacy and new hospital staff housing, as well as a new pavilion where families and staff can gather together. By far the hospital's most ambitious project to date has been the construction of a 9,000 square foot surgical center. This courageous effort has been part of the original growth plan since 2008. Over the years, many patients requiring surgery have had to be referred to other hospitals in Uganda. Our team knew that Holy Innocence has a great track record of providing superior hospital care for children and we knew it could provide equally outstanding care for surgical patients if it could only build a surgical centre. Starting in 2013, the hospital began raising funds for the surgical centre. This project is significantly more complex than the original hospital due to the need for an ultra-sterile environment. Holy Innocence Children's Hospital successfully broke ground on the surgical centre in late 2015. Our team knew that, as with the hospital, demand would grow dramatically, so the surgical centre was designed with two operating rooms from the very beginning. Thankfully, construction of the surgical centre is now complete. Nearly all the equipment has been installed, including a modern digital X-ray system to provide images that can be sent via email or text messaging for consultations with US surgeons. Laminar flow equipment, which is necessary to prevent infection during surgery, is the last item that needs to be installed before the surgical centre opens. As with the hospital staff, Holy Innocence Children's Hospital wants to offer housing to all key surgical centre employees. This is a significant benefit that will enable us to hire and retain superior qualified personnel. This new housing will cost $400,000. Thanks to our generous donors, we have raised $150,000 already. Our immediate need now is to raise another $250,000 to complete this effort. We hope to break ground on this project in December 2018. And with your help, we know we can make this hope a reality. Greetings to you all and greetings from the Archdiocese of Mbarara. My name is Father Bonaventure Triyum Mazma also known as Father B. I speak on behalf of the Archdiocese of Mbarara. 
I have seen holy innocents grow from a dream to a life-saving reality for thousands of children and their parents saving their lives. And I speak on behalf of the Archdiocese of Mbarara to express my appreciation for the compassion, for the care, and for all that has been contributed that has made this dream a reality. In particular, I would like to express my thank you on behalf of the Archdiocese of Barara to San Rafael Parish community that has generously and willingly donated to make this dream a reality. You have sacrificed a lot, you have done a lot so that the children of Mbarara and in this region may live and may survive. Know that you are giving these children life, you are giving them hope, you are giving them a future. And we thank you and we ask the Lord to bless you abundantly. Asante sana and may God continue to bless you. Thank you very much. <laughs>